In SpaceClaim 2010, we've completely renovated the sheet metal functionality by adding its own tab on the ribbon bar, allowing you to quickly convert 3D models to sheet metal components and also convert any joints to the specific junction that you'd like in the sheet metal, creating no overlap or bend joints with the click of a mouse. We've also included all of the tools that you'll ever need to use in this sheet metal tab allowing you to quickly make bends on your sheet metal part and also split sheet metal tabs in half. The pull tool and move tool have been located here as well allowing specific functionality within the context of a sheet metal part and also including sketch tools allowing you to sketch directly on your sheet metal to add new material or sketch perpendicular to your sheet metal plate to quickly add new tabs to your design as well. In SpaceClaim 2010 we've also added a forms library within sheet metal to create embosses and cutouts from a standard library. For each of these forms you can edit all of the dimensions seeing exactly what the final view will look like changing length and width as well as rotation and placing the updated shape on your sheet metal part. With a complex pattern like you see on screen it's very difficult to update the heavy cutouts for all of these instances but in SpaceClaim 2010, we've added functionality for lightweight patterns. So by selecting our pattern instance and converting to lightweight, we can now make the same updates to our design and see that update at a much faster rate. We've also added the ability to make lightweight cutouts of text. So in my unbent state, I can show that text and convert it to a lightweight cutout and see that change reflected in my bent state as well, making modifications and seeing that update on screen.